call it the business machine building was the original Takaichi print shop, the forerunner of National Print Company. And uh, it was run by Mr. Takaichi and his wife. And the amazing thing was they had to pick up, they, they printed Japanese and Chinese things. And they had to pick each character by forceps, tweezers, and set it up. And they could have to look at it backwards, you see. They had to look at it backwards, put it up, and set it up, and then, hi Mary, and then put it on so that they can print it on the machine. It wasn't a liner type machine or anything like that. And the missus, the lady would be the one that was picking it up and then when she'd have to replace it in order again. It was amazing. I, I was fascinated. And they printed a lot of lottery tickets because gambling was very popular in those days. Uh -huh. And it's, you know, like the California lottery. Now you pick 10 uh, Chinese characters out of this 100 or so. Right. And every day there was at least two drawings or something like that. In, in those days it was about when? Before 1923. Okay. okay. I'm talking about 1910 right. and you know 15, 20, okay. and so forth. Okay. The, the next building, the two-story building, where the tofu shop is, we, my, my father, moved here from the other store on Jackson Street in the uh, 20s, early 20s, and. Uh, See, he had a store downstairs. My mother did a lot of sewing, custom sewing, and uh, my father watched the store. We lived upstairs, and uh, we had a common telephone between the print shop and our, and our store. Oh, that's great. They had a hole in the wall, and either side could answer the phone.